Imagine a sandstorm so powerful. It grinds stone into dust. There is no modern technology, no electricity, no concrete. How do you survive? The people of ancient Mesopotamia didn't just survive. They engineered solutions that still defy belief. They didn't fight the wind, they outsmarted it. Their doorways were never straight. Wind was forced down a winding, airlock entryway. The first turn immediately killed its velocity. The heavy sand? It dropped in the first chamber. All that entered the home was clean, cool air. Persian engineers took it a step further. They built the bad gear, the wind catcher. These tall towers would catch the hot desert wind and force it down, channeling it over subterranean water canals called Xanats. The result? Evaporative cooling. A natural zero energy air conditioner. But the Nabataeans took the most radical solution. They reasoned, if no wall can stop the storm, why build a wall at all? They didn't build on the landscape. They carved their entire city into it. The sandstorms would arrive and simply pass over the city, buried within the cliffs of Petra. Subtractive architecture. They understood physics without the formulas. Their systems were resilient designed with nature, not against it. Today, our robust, power-dependent systems fail in an instant. Perhaps the greatest innovations for our future are already hidden, waiting in our ancient past.